Nash and Garrett feels at home wrestling in Grace Hall. After all, the Cornell graduate and 2016 NCAA champion at 133 pounds never lost in Lehigh University's legendary gym, the home of Lehman Turner Arena. I really like wrestling here, said Garrett at Friday's news conference ahead of Saturday's USA Wrestling Final X, 7 p.m., in which Garrett will take on Joe Colon for the 61kg, 134-pound berth on the U.S. Freestyle team heading to the United World Wrestling World Championships in Budapest, Hungary, October 20-28. I have fond memories, what Garrett hopes is the crowd might forget about it's less than fond memories of him, after all the big red is Lehigh's arch nemesis. It will be nice wrestling here without all the fans rooting against me and maybe even cheering for me, Garrett said. Garrett and Colin will be one of three best of three matches that will determine spots on the U.S. Freestyle team Saturday night, seven of the men's berths were decided at the two previous Final X events in Lincoln, Nebraska and State College. The American Greco-Roman team has been selected by a different process. Meeting at 92 kilograms, 202 pounds, will be three-time NCAA champion and Olympic and world bronze medalist Jaden Cox against 2015 North Dakota State All-American and veteran Greco-Roman athlete Hayden Zilmer, while at 125 kilos, 275 pounds, two-time NCAA champ and 2017 world bronze medalist Nick Wiesdowski will face three-time Michigan All-American Adam Kuhn, the 2018 U.S. Open Freestyle Champion, Kuhn, indeed, has already clinched a trip to Budapest when he won the 130-kilo berth on the Greco-Roman squad Friday in Tulsa. He left that event immediately after its close to fly to Bethlehem for Final X. Kuhn, who of course was not at Friday's news conference, is trying to become the first U.S. wrestler since Greg Gibson in 1982 to make both world teams. But he'll have a tough road against the athletic and powerful Gwiazdowski, who tasted success at the Worlds in Paris in 2017 and wants more. It's been nine months since Paris and I am confident in my ability and my focus, said Gwiazdowski, who is a returning world medalist earned a final X berth automatically. I have been focusing on scoring more and shooting more, shooting with the intention of scoring rather than just stopping the wrestling for a minute. That's what I have been trying to put into action. The 92-kilo bout could be the major highlight as the intensely driven Cox meets the versatile and aggressive Zilmer in a rematch of their U.S. Open final 1-2-0 by Cox in Las Vegas in April. Cox is not really focused on just getting to Worlds, I am tired of just riding along, guys like Jordan Burroughs get gold and I want to walk beside them, not follow them, he said. Guys like Jordan show me where I want to be. I sure as heck don't want silver and I really don't want bronze but at least with bronze you win something. I had a few slip UOPS the last couple of years at the Olympics and Worlds. I want to win gold medals, Zilmer presents an interesting contrast as he's fairly new to freestyle, having concentrated on Greco-Roman in the past. I think my freestyle is a lot better now and it's better to focus on just one style, Zilmer said. I'd love to get a wrestle off with a 97 kilo Greco Roman champ, but I am looking to freestyle. Garrett, meanwhile, enters Grace Hall for once as the underdog against Cologne, the 2018 Pan American champion. They have met twice in freestyle recently, with Colon taking both, including a 20 to 13 win in the U.S. Open final in April. We have wrestled multiple times before, and I am ready to go, Colin said. So is Garrett, who went 149-12 for the Big Red in college and qualified for Final X with an impressive win over Penn State graduate Nico Megalutis in the finals of the World Team Trials Challenge Tournament in Rochester, Minnesota, in May. The transition from folk style to freestyle was difficult for me, Garrett said. It's a completely different style and I really had to learn the technique. It's an honor to be here and I love to show off my moves for the crowd, if Garrett does just that, one suspects the Grace Hall crowd will love him back. Brad Wilson may be reached at bwilson at lehighvalleylive.com. Follow him on Twitter at bradsports.